At Mayfield's United Livestock Commodities, owner Joseph Watson is tweaking the recipe for success. Just to be able to survive, we have to look for uh, other sources of nutrition. His 1,400 cattle are no longer feeding off corn. The prices, Watson says, are too high to keep in stock. So earlier this year, he began to buy secondhand candy. It has a higher ratio of fat than actually feeding straight corn. Which is important because all of these cattle will be brought to slaughter. So Watson wants them to gain weight, and by feeding them chocolate, it gets the job done. It's hard to believe it will work, but I mean, we've already seen the results of it now. With all this candy, you might be asking yourself, can this really be healthy? Watson says it is because he monitors the cattle's daily intake. He says they've had no real health problems, and the proof is in their weight. This ration's balanced to have not too much fat in it. Watson mixes the candy with an ethanol byproduct and a mineral nutrient. The packaged candy comes from various companies at a discounted rate because it's not fit for store shelves. Salvage is a problem for a lot of these companies and they're proud to have a place to go with it. And Watson's proud to take it because it's helping him financially and helping his cattle physically. Lots of happy cattle.